You had a, a dope interview with Funny Marco. I oh, it up for Carlin. Hey! So Carlin. But it was funny. It was dope. But it looked it like it was awkward. It looked it like it was some. You know, I don't know if this cutting the camera like that to I make that look me. like that. I didn't know Did what this was going on. Really interview you like that? Yes. Yeah, we on Boss Talk 101. 101. Yeah, we gon' talk. Cat Williams went on Shannon Sharp. Shut down all of the comedians. Uh -huh. he, he named about 42 niggas just, oh, this one gotta get it. Oh, this <laughs> one gotta get it. Man, oh, hold up, man. I gotta take another drink. You know what I'm <laughs> saying? So I was like, man, you know, like, what did you think when you seen that 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 whole that whole that interview? The number two interview on YouTube today. Now, there has been now another one on that level. I Except for Joe Rogan. I didn't watch it. What? I seen some clips on Facebook. I didn't watch because they say it's like two hours long. It is. I can't sit still for two hours. <laughs> I can't. So I watched a couple of clips where he was talking about it. I was like, oh. Okay. Have you watched some? You've heard some responses. Yeah. Uh -huh. <laughs> I, 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 I heard it. I, I read a little bit. I'm like, okay. Um, I don't know. Good that, you know, they didn't call your name. Yeah. You know, they'd be happy you didn't get, you know, yeah. get a little bit of that. Yeah. No, Mike God. F said he wished he did get yeah. called. Yeah, I did. Open some doors for some folks that probably hadn't never, True. hadn't had nothing happening in a minute. I like Cat crazy. He funny, he crazy. But I ain't, that's all I'm going to say about him. <laughs> no, he don't want to be on his That is all I'm going to say about Have him. Have you met him before? No, I actually supposed to have been on his tour. Oh, really? Uh, yeah, some uh, people that... Uh, was on his tour, I guess, uh, they was doing the booking and stuff. And they reached out to me. I was doing my own tour then, so I couldn't. Oh, know. okay. Okay, well, I'm going to be real with you. You know, uh, it was a thing he said, and I know you have ties with uh, Ricky Smiley. You you went and did some stuff with Ricky before. You've been on his show. Uh, I ain't been on his show. You ain't never did open with him? No. What? Did, I, what? I, I thought uh, y'all opened together before. I I, you talking about the radio show? No, I'm talking about. Oh, I did a, a church. Show. Yeah, I did a church event with him. Uh, hosted a church. That's event. what I'm talking about. So yeah. you you know him? Yeah. If you see him, you'd be like, "Hey, what's up, Ricky? What's yeah. up? What's and up, Carol? Like, Who are you? No, nah, he won't know my that name. That nigga like, like that? Nah, he don't know me like that. He uh oh, he I don't. Mean, he won't even look at your comedy when he was on the show with. You. I don't know. What type of thing I did? You know, that, this the real fact, show. Listen, you ever want to go? I'm saying. Matter of fact, I did when Ricky. We we kind of like lock locked in because. I was doing the old lady at that event. That's what I'm thinking. So he was hearing to me. I started doing my own material, and he was finding it so funny. He was giving me his jokes and saying, "Say this, say this." So really? we kept, so, yeah. so he ought to know you then. He sure don't get on here. I had I don't know about no, drinking. No, we no more. He was the walk in together. I don't play like that girl. If he was to walk in right now, he'll probably hey, what's up? Hey, what's up? That's all he'll probably say. He don't know me like that. And that been a minute. That been a long time. I wasn't doing no Jesse said he knew the nigga. And oh, he and the, everybody know Jesse. Yeah. yeah. That's what I'm saying. So it's Dr. Martin Luther you. King even know Jesse. <laughs> <laughs> so everybody so know so Jesse so. gonna make you know him. That's <laughs> sure. You, Jesse could come here and fall right now. He'll do it. And five years later, you're like, that's a nigga that fell behind like me, ain't it? Oh, yeah. You, he'll make you remember him. Hey, man. Yeah. I just want to ask you, man. Like, you had a, a dope interview with Funny Marco. I hope it up for Carlin. Curling. But it was funny. It was dope. But it looked it like it was awkward. It looked it like it was some. You know, I don't know if this nigga cutting the camera like that to I make that look me. like that. I didn't know Did what this was going nigga on. Really interview you like that? Yes, I ended up going with my partner, and they said I was in Atlanta doing my uh, shows there for the weekend, and he knew Funny Marco and stuff like that. And he was like, "Uh, man, Curvin in town doing my interview." He was like, "Bring him down." So I'm like, "Okay." Where the script? Now, who was like, this? It, it, who uh, uh, it his name is uh, Big V. Okay. His name Big V. And so. he linked you up. Yeah. And we got in there. I'm like, okay. Everybody, they, he was doing some, uh, who was there? Ray J and um, what's Lil Wayne's daughter name? Ray uh, Janae? Ray Janae. Both of them was there. And I'm like, okay, uh, where, the, where the script is? Like, what what we do? And he talking to me while they micing me up and stuff. I'm like, how we, how we going to do this? He's like, you just sit in the chair. And stuff like that. I'm like, okay. So he started cutting the camera on, went in. So everything he asked me, I'm like, okay. Like, I'm looking crazy. I'm like, nigga, do I answer that for real? And I seen it. Was, it, it, it I'm telling you, it feels so just he like that. He like it like that. Yeah, it's like that. And then when you think, 
you cut the camera out, he still talk, he still record. So he enjoy the awkwardness. Yeah, yeah. You know, and and I talk. I, he probably been coming on my show, but the nigga done got too Hollywood. He too big now. I ain't even expecting that. You know, y'all know how y'all do me. Yeah, you, you and don't not me. Nah. I don't do you. Nah, you know how y'all do me. Nah, nah Carlos ain't. Miller, the only one showed up for me. And was just nigga, I'm here. Oh yeah, nigga, it, it, it was. This my first. Remember what I said? Yeah, this my first time. I can't, I can't skip, knowing I can't, you wanted me I can't, on the show. I can't, I can't even get mad. I at reminded you. my manager. I say, nigga, hit him up. Let's go do it. I try to work with everybody. I, I, I just know. Lie. I just know when you went on Funny Marco. I'm gonna go back to that. It was like he asked you, "Was you fake?" Yeah. It was. It, it was a few things he asked you. That was just one of the ones that stick out for me. Um, it seemed like you didn't know which angle he was coming at. I didn't. I love the way he interviewed. Yeah, and I love it because it's different and it's heels. Yeah. Anytime a nigga hustle, I love to hustle. I like the way Carlos Miller come in here and me and him cut up and talk about country stuff. Mm -hmm. He can come back anytime. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. <laughs> but yeah. but then uh, you you work with him too, right? Yep. What well, you guys y'all did some shows together? Or yep. Just what made you guys link up? How did you even meet him? We from the same same he from state. Mississippi. Yeah, we from the but same I don't state. mean he from the same city. We not from the same city. We from the same state. So. Ended up a promoter put both of us on the same show. Okay. I was the host. So automatically we we connected just like that. We ended up uh chilling now. He had hit camera. Um he started giving me a shout out on his stuff and stuff That's like good. that. We uh we were supposed to do the show at a certain time. We didn't do the show till probably two two hours later because the pro the promoter didn't have the money. He ain't have our money, so was you upset? We went, nah, I wasn't upset. We you went to uh, we went to you supposed to kick the chair down or something. Nah, we was outside. We was actually waiting for him to come. He came. He was like, man, I'm waiting on the dude to come in and get the money. Then Carlos looking at me like, nigga, this, this sound like some nigga shit, right? <laughs> <laughs> Did you <laughs> ask you? Ask you? But no, he love. said it sound like he, he looking at me. He like, well, nigga, we not doing the show until we get the money. <laughs> So he was like, y'all going up there and well, do it. Start, I been there. start the show and I'm going to pay y'all. I'm like, nigga, we not I doing that. I can't be no, nothing like that. I'm going to be laughing. I ain't gonna then lie nigga going to look at me. I'm supposed to be host. Nigga going to look at me. Set. Then nigga going to say, I'll give you some gas money. Uh -uh. Gas money. Oh, no. I'm not finna get up there. You finna pay me. I ain't finna get up there. So we walked to the dollar store. Who is he promoting? He still doing janky, it? Janky, janky promote. He still doing it? I don't know. He ain't went back. Nope. He ain't booked me. What city we all in? Uh, Montgomery. He know who he is. Oh, Alabama. Yeah. 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 And if you hear his name come up, you'll never go. <laughs> <laughs> Run out for the plug, nigga. You cannot book me. Because I'm going to think the money counterfeit. I'm like, uh -uh. no, you cannot book me. So would you, I mean, the, the, Club Shay Shay, that's a that's a good podcast to go on. He getting crazy numbers, man. True. Like uh, he's having a lot of the brothers coming on there. Man, my boy Bubba Dub, you you know Bubba Dub. I work with that's him. That's my nigga right yeah, there. Yeah, I work with him. Uh, how 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 did you link up with him? I didn't even know Prom if you knew him. Promoter, promoter, they linked y'all yep. in. Yeah, man, y'all got funny. a lot of new dope people, man. I don't know how y'all turn it on and off though. Y'all 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 up all night and they doing all these voiceovers. They oh, yeah. Bubba Dub about to break his bus his top vessel <laughs> in his mouth. About the Cowboys, about the Lakers. Yeah, the trash. Yeah, the trash. Mm -hmm. Like, like, like. That nigga funny, man. You guys have figured it out. Yeah, we on Boss Talk 101. 101. Yeah, we gonna talk.